Hey, that's Mike and Holly, Alex, Eddie, and Kelsey. And then there was light. <laughs> That's how dark it is in here. It's, we're at that point, bless you. We're at that point where we're getting storms every day again. It's like you can almost set your clock by it or set your schedule by it. It rains every single day in the, in the like afternoon. And it just got really dark and started raining and thunder and lightning and Eddie is hiding in the bathroom behind the toilet. It's not oh, bad right yeah. now. We're getting to the point now where when it does rain like this, <laughs> like it's not cold by any means outside, but because it's cloudy and the rain comes, the air conditioning it makes the in air the house that much more powerful in the house. Yeah, it still runs full blast anyway. Oh my so gosh, our air conditioner! It, oh, I just saw some lightning. Like it's not hot out, but like I have to put on the long sleeve because it's cold in here. On the hose. Your guys' shoes probably got wet. What? We took off our shoes, so we played outside last night, what? and I stepped in dog poo, <laughs> and I didn't know it, but like Chelsea was like, Mom, there's poo right there, and I was like, oh, I was just over there. So because we haven't been able to go outside and scoop and all of that because of the rain, I stepped in poo. So we took our shoes off outside last night, and I never brought them back in just because, oh man, <laughs> what do you think of that? So yeah, it, it definitely like cools down the house, which is nice because it's been so hot and the air conditioner just runs and runs and runs. That's crazy. But, oh, am I gonna get snuggles because it's stormy? Oh, I'll take it. All of a sudden, I like the storms even more. All right, guys, remember like the last two, three days, I was trying to have Chelsea's first day of school. Yesterday, I worked on this board and I took her pictures with it. So it was like the official, official first day of school with her board. And I tried to post the pictures on Instagram and something was wrong. Something's been wrong with my Instagram. It's not working properly. So I, was, I didn't get to post them. <laughs> I was like, oh my gosh. So yesterday between, I was wanting, no, the day before, I was wanting that to be her first day of school. The internet, or the website that I planned to use as part of her curriculum wasn't working. Then uh, yesterday I had done all this work on this board and didn't show it to you guys and then couldn't post it on Instagram. So it's just been like kind of one thing after another, whatever, we just roll with it. So I wanted to show you the board that I did for Chelsea. This is a dry erase board. And what I did is I had her stand next to it so you could see how tall she is. And um, so there's her name. I'm seven years old. I'm in second grade. I want to rescue animals when I grow up. Her Don't favorite. Don't forget to be her subject. Yeah, I will. I'll go back. Her favorite things are unicorns, horses, cousins, cupcakes, cinnamon toast, puppies, kittens, and rainbows. Her favorite subject is music. She likes to play soccer, Minecraft, Roblox, Zelda, and spies. She plays spies with her cousins. My teacher is mommy. And I was gonna do like my principal or something is daddy, but <laughs> daddy really, yeah, daddy really just <laughs> uh, brings down the hammer. No, I'm just kidding. So anyway, um, we did that yesterday, took pictures, and then I had pulled out, we had those rainbow hearts on there from when we did that whole uh, rainbow heart thing for the neighbors. Um, pulled out some of her workbooks, but I don't think we're going to do these workbooks. That one is for a first grade. We're in second grade. And also so, diary. oh, look at her. See, there she is standing next to it. So big. Oh, yes, yeah, this one. Um, this is Chelsea's diary. Have you written in it lately? Mm, some, spy stuff. some spy stuff. Oh, top secret, right? Yeah. Nobody's allowed to see what's in there. Mm -hmm. um, and. Except cousins? Oh, wow. It's a secret cousin diary. Because you're all secret spies together? Yeah. yeah. wow. So all yeah, your spies... Spies can share secrets. Oh, for spies' eyes only, huh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, so they've got some top secret stuff going on. And then underneath her desk, I have um, some of her other stuff that I just kind of like... It's funny because I'll pull it out and I'll go through it and I'll be like, oh yeah, we can do this or we can do that or whatever. And then a lot of it I'll just put back in there for another time. So mm -hmm. um, it's kind of funny how, how we do things, right? Mm -hmm. Lots and lots of reading, writing, and that sort of thing. All right, and Chelsea, one of the things that she likes to do in her spare time 
And also it's proven to be quite educational as well as uh, build in Minecraft. So yeah. she's got something that she wants to show me in her Minecraft. And so I usually, da, 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 da. wow, is that your roller coaster? Yeah. <gasps> Did you finish it? Mm-hmm, it's all finished. No way, can you ride it? Yeah, you actually can. Really? And also in the middle, I put you on You Weren't you just telling me last night that you were gonna make it and now it's done? Wow, she is like really, really good, I think. I don't know, I don't know Minecraft. Like Michael and I have not really, Alex was really into it, you know, when she was younger and even it, once in a while, I think she might still dabble with it. You see what, I, what it looks like. On but like head. Chelsea's really into it and <laughs> there she goes yeah, on her. Going. Wow. Oh. wow. Might make you throw up if it was in real life. <laughs> Maybe in real life, huh? I don't know. Mommy loves roller coasters. Hey, let's make some brownies. <laughs> Chelsea and I were upstairs, and Michael comes up, and it's like storming and stuff. And he's like, "Want to make some brownies?" <laughs> I'm like, okay. Sure, why not? I got some chunks going on in here. So we're ready, I think, to add. Hold on a second. The cocoa powder. I tried some plain. It's yummy, isn't it? She's like, I want to try some cocoa powder. That's one of those things where, oh, it looks, it's it chocolatey. Looks, it looks well, wonderful. It looks like it would taste really good. And it doesn't. And then you taste it and it's like, ooh. You know, I don't think I've ever made brownies not from a box. Hold your breath. Have I? I, I make my, um, don't think so. I make my uh, chocolate cookies. I forget what they're called, but the really good chocolate Ooh. cookies at Christmas time that taste like brownie. Yeah. Um, but I don't think I've ever made like brownie brownie. I never thought of that. No, we've only ever made it from the box. Where mm -hmm. you oh, pour man. in a ton of like oil. <laughs> I hope it turns out okay. <laughs> it looks really good. It's good. Now we did use coconut oil, so it has just that tiniest little hint of coconut to it. I mean, no, it, has, it hasn't cooked though yet either. It hasn't so cooked. I think once you bake it. I don't have egg. I just have two little bits. We just wanted to taste what the batter tasted like. It's good. It's nice and rich. Okay, so now we're gonna dump. We have this much oh. chocolate chips left. Here, don't need any more of them. Should I dump them in? She was. She was like grabbing. We're like, we need them for the brownies. <laughs> well, I don't think you really do. I think it's just a like texture thing. So there's little chocolate chip bites Melted throughout. Chocolate chip bites. We might as well just use it and get and rid of them. These are semi sweet. The recipe calls for milk chocolate, I think. But I mean, we had ah, them. Ah, that'll be fine. If we had them, we had them open, and we don't have as many as they call for. All right, Chelsea's gonna give it a little taste on camera. It's only been out of the oven a few minutes. I do think it probably turned out a little cakey. The recipe said something about it being a cakier brownie instead of like a fudgy, sticky brownie. So it tastes like really cocoa-y when you first taste it for a few minutes. Mm. That's good. I know the chocolate chips were supposed to add a little flavor too, is what the recipe said. It would have been nice if we would have maybe had some more of those, but. Pretty good. Pretty good? All right, so I'm gonna be a little critical of this because we used to buy this box brownie that you just added like egg and oil or whatever. And Duncan just, Hines or something, Pillsbury maybe. And I really, I think it was Duncan Hines, yeah. And I really liked it and it was like, had chocolate chunks in it. I needed more chocolate chips. It's not, it's not brownie enough. It's a little cakey, but she said you needed to add the chocolate chips for more flavor. I agree, it's good, it's not bad, but I like the more fudgy ones. Okay, time for Michael to try. Yeah, I mean, the package mix, you can buy it and it'll say, do you want it fudgy-like or do you want it cake-like? Mm -hmm. It's cake-like. It's, yeah. it's a little too cake-like for my liking. I'd rather have it be more fudgy, but I don't know. It's okay. it's not bad. It's okay, but it's not the best. Yes. I was really hoping more for to like knock your socks off. This oh. is amazing type. Yeah, it's cake-like. I don't yeah. know how you fix that, but. Add more chocolate. 
All right, so a little correction. The first um, pieces that we all had were an edge piece, and Michael cut into it a little bit more, and he said it does get a little Here, let's bit. Get even more in the middle. He said it does get. Oh, you can even yeah. see where it's moister. Take, take a bite of that. So that's right from in that's, the middle. That's that's like ooh ooh. <laughs> oh, how warm. Oh yeah. Oh, snoozy McGee. This is where he's been for a while now. Snoozing on the pillows. I, am I disturbing you? I know. Oh, I'll stop. 